Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? Word on the street is that the locusts are swarming the underworks. Patrol gonna get it under control before the shit hits the fan? <laughs> Unlikely. High command's about as interested in the slums as they are the underworks. Why try to spit shine a turd? And what's it to you anyway? As it goes, little nuisances have a way of becoming big problems over time. Proliferation. And I'd be willing to pay to nip it in the bud now, before they start to hit our warehouses and personnel, too. Well, you'd have more luck killing them in their nests than hunting them one by one. Or you could booby trap the tunnels and catch the rats while they roam. Your call. Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? Made the traps you suggested. Now they just have to be set to catch the locusts. And I'll make sure they find their way to the tunnels. Keep the filthy things from reaching the surface and poaching our goods. And Lieutenant, thank you for caring. The poorest of us rarely get shown such concern. It's your lucky day. I need a favor, if you have the time, on top of the missions the captain already gave you. Depends on the favor. Soldiers back from the front are barricaded inside the warehouse. But they think Aurora's outside and they're in the middle of a war zone. They've terrorized the merchants, but honestly, that's not even the worst of it. According to internal reports, they're not just soldiers. They're test subjects for a new combat drug that increases their strength tenfold. The paranoia is probably a result of the drug, but it makes the situation even more dangerous. I would prefer it if you could reason with them. You could use force, but in their state, the drugs could push them over the edge. A straight-up fight could kill them. First things first, we need to help get them quarantined and away from civilians to prevent further collateral damage. I know you're up to your neck and other responsibilities, but please, this is a favor for me and a favor for the guys. If the ASC handles it instead, I know I'm gonna be writing letters of condolences. Don't let it come to that. How's he think a noob who's not even a real soldier will be able to reason with a corporal hopped up on some super drug? He knows technomancers aren't magicians, right? Pipe down, Lieutenant will find a way. Maybe we just need to find the Corporal's family to help talk him down. Look at me, <laughs> I'm just full of ideas. Soldier, please let me in. It's imperative I speak. Ma'am, your husband. He's one of the soldiers who returned yesterday? Yes! I'm Corporal Tyrone Ward's wife. So he is back? Why haven't I been permitted to see him? What's wrong? Ma'am, he's safe, but he's scared. Paranoid. Suffering severe post-traumatic stress. So what I need for you to do is tell me something, anything that might help me convince him to listen, before he gets himself killed. Tell him I'm here. Tell him I'm waiting to see him. Dying to see him. Tell him about the ribbon he sent me for my hair, and that it's not just me waiting anymore. That he's... we're... going to have a child soon.
Unfortunately, this is beyond my skill level. Corporal, let's chat. You wanna chat? Sure, why not? Not like we're at war here. Let's just have a goddamn tea party! Whatever you wanna chat about! Oh shit, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. I didn't see your stripes. Your uniform threw me off, sir. My mistake. It's fine, Corporal. Stand down. Listen, Corporal, you're confused, you're scared, and I get that. Not a lot is making sense to you, but you have to trust me. You're back in Ophir, and your wife, Maya, she's worried about you. Maya? How the hell do you know my wife's name? Did you do something to... Your wife's fine, Corporal. She even told me about that ribbon you sent her. She told you about the ribbon? I, I don't... I don't understand. There was a goddamn war raging out there. I heard it. We were under siege. If we're in Ophir, you're telling me it's under siege? It was. The fighting's done, though. You held the warehouse like men. So just relax and return to your barracks. Rest. And wait for your wife. She has some good news for you. Good news? Of what? The best kind. Trust me. The kind that'll be a reason to stay safe. Stay alive. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Men, listen up. Lower your arms. We're heading back to the barracks. On the double. Unfortunately, this is beyond my skill level. Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? I solved your problem, Quartermaster. Is that so? And how'd it go? No lives lost. But if we don't find an antidote to the drug, I doubt those men will see a day outside a cell for the rest of their lives. Thanks, Lieutenant. We owe you one. A friend of mine working on the test actually sent us a sample, and we should be able to make an antidote with it. Eventually, I hope. Give me the sample. I know someone who could probably find the cure quickly. Thank you, Lieutenant. If he succeeds, he will help us out a lot. Here, take this.
Lieutenant, should we maybe get the civilians away from the plaza? It might be safer. Good point. Yeah, let's ask him to move back. Fortunately, this is beyond my skill level. Fortunately, this is beyond my skill level. My boy, I have a favor to ask you. I've lost something. I have a sample of a drug that was administered to the soldiers. We absolutely need an antidote. Can you do that? Of course. You know, you could have probably made it yourself. If you would listen to the science lessons I was trying to teach you... Oh well, you preferred to throw lightning bolts. I remember that time. Scott, here's the sample. Can I get an antidote? You think that I'm senile? You'll see. Give me some time. Take this. It wasn't that complicated. I made you one dose, and I wrote down the formula on it. They'll be on their own for making others. Thank you, Scott. Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? I went to a friend for a solution to our antidote problem, and he found one. That's the kind of good news you don't get every day. You could stop a hundred terrorist attacks and still not save as many lives as you have with that antidote, Lieutenant. <laughs> 